Hello everyone, this is uh, Shadi Reyes from CVI 2022 in Denver. I'm really privileged today to be with Mina Youssef. He's a physician coming from Cairo University. Mina, nice to see you. Nice to see you too, uh, Dr. Shadi. It's a pleasure to be in CVI for the second time. Yeah, exactly. You told us it's your second time here. So I'm, I'm assuming you liked it and you came back. Yeah, yeah, I liked it a lot. Yeah. Um, you are going to be presenting to, later today a challenging bifurcation case. Yes. If you can walk us through what makes the patient go to intervention and what's your technique. Yeah. Uh, it's a complex bifurcation case. Uh, he's a 78 years old uh, patient. Uh, he had uh, multiple comorbidities that made cabbage uh, not an option. The surgeons refused him actually. So we proceeded to PCI. Yeah. Uh, we used the IVIS to guide us through uh, from planning uh, through the procedure and after this. And I used the mini crush technique and it went well, thanks God. Yeah. So tell us about the role of imaging in bifurcation, pre and post and during the procedure. How do you, pra how do you practice IVIS? Yeah, we pra in Egypt, IVIS is uh, a bit expensive, so it's not in all cases. Uh, we use it mainly for the left main bifurcations in Egypt. I know here it, it's done in most of the cases as I attended yesterday. We hope. <laughs> yeah, but it's it's not the case in uh, our country. It's right. only for the uh, left main bifurcations uh, to plan the procedure in the beginning to make sure that uh, the left main diameter, to make sure that the left main is diseased or not, to make sure it's uh, Medina 111 uh, classification or not. Uh, after this, to size, uh, to prepare the lesions, to make sure there is no calcium needing uh, atherectomy or something. Uh, after this, we uh, go through with the PCI and we make sure that our stents are well expanded, the side branches are well uh, opened yeah. and so on. Yeah. So walk us through the step for mini crush that you did. Okay. In mini crush, uh, it's when you have a side branch and you need to protect uh, first. Uh, you go with wiring both branches, preparing the lesions in both branches. Uh, you park a stent in the uh, side branch with a bit of protrusion into the main vessel and you park either a balloon or a stent in the main branch, uh, main vessel to the main branch. Uh, then you uh, expand the side branch stent, remove it and remove the wire in the side branch. Then you crush the part protruding uh, of the uh, side branch stent. Mm -hmm. Uh, then you exchange, you rewire the side branch, do kissing, and uh, if you have put uh, a part in the main branch that uh, allowed you to do pot, this would be uh, very good. ideal. Yeah. yeah. Did you perform pots in your uh, case? Yes, I did pot. Yeah. yeah. Because maybe the left main was a bit bigger. Than... Yeah, left main was bigger, and uh, you know the uh, elliptical versus the circular uh, results yeah. after this. Yeah. yeah. Any atherectomy performed? No. Uh, thanks, uh, they didn't need a right. yeah. So tell me a little bit, uh, what kind of atherectomy devices do you have in your lab? Uh, we don't have a atherectomy uh, fixed in our lab, but we can get it when we need it. Mm. Uh, the one we have is the rotational atherectomy. We don't have orbital atherectomy or laser uh, in Egypt. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. So when you, when you say rotational, do you, you always use a pacemaker for RCA or any other? No, we don't do this routinely, no. Not routinely. So unless no. the patient develops something, then you, you lose Yeah, we have it on site, but it's not routine, no. Because this question come, comes back on the panel all the time. Yeah. With pacemaker, no pacemaker, rotational, orbital. Yeah. yeah. Um, well, congratulations for the case and good luck for the yeah. presentation today. And thanks for being with us in Denver. Thank you, Shady. Thank yeah. you. It Thank was you. good that I would get to meet you. Thank you, Dr. Thank you. Yusuf. Have a good day. Please watch this video and others on CVI YouTube channel. This is Shadir Reyes from Denver, Colorado.